All right, Fox. First first tournament out of the gate. A, a lot of wins. A lot of smashing people, actually. I saw one where you almost tucked the guy, 16 to two. 16 to 4 maybe against Clarion guy and then you pin the Penn State guy in the final but how'd you feel today? Uh, you know it was, it was a little weird you know the beginning of the tournament uh, I had some butterflies I was trying to think that going into it I didn't have those butterflies but uh, my feet were a little heavier than I thought my stomach felt a little queasier than I thought once I got on the mat so getting that out of the way was a little tough uh, felt a little sluggish first match took a while to get around that first match but uh, pulled it together and by the end of the day I was wrestling my best in the tournament uh, wrestling better, uh, and doing better against them, so it was a good day. College is a lot different. There's not as much scoring, so much position fighting, a lot more mat wrestling. It's just totally different than what you're used to wrestling, kind of a wide open style you have where you're scoring a lot. You scored a lot today. Yeah, yeah. Um, it was tough getting uh, get, it's tough getting used to take, uh, selecting my shots. Uh, you know, it's not as easy to find my positions and get to ties I want. People are finding their ties and getting takedowns on me. So it was difficult, you know, getting used to that and uh, being a little more patient. But once I got rolling, I know I found I found the positions that I wrestled best in, and I was able to score a lot more. By the end of the day, I felt I could find my positions and uh, hand fight to my positions. Uh, you did not wear a UVA singlet today. That tells me you're red shirting. What, am, I, am I reading that correctly? Are you red shirting? You're not red shirting. Don't you guys know yet? Uh, you know, we don't know yet. Uh, I mean, we can't. We're not going to make that decision coming into my first tournament. Uh, so we came here, you know, we didn't know how it was going to feel. Uh, went up to 74 last week. We made that decision to see how it felt. So I had to see. I see what, what it feel like, you know, how I'd feel coming in after weigh-in, uh, wrestling a tough guy first round, you know. Uh, it's one of the best, probably would have been one of the best guys in high school I would have wrestled very first round here. So I had to be able to compete first round. Uh, in a college situation, so that was that was different. It's different trying to figure that out. We're gonna sit down. We're gonna talk about it, and we'll figure it out. The coaches will do what's best for me. I'll tell the coaches how I felt about the tournament, and we'll see how it goes. Looking at UVA this year, you know, you guys, Blaze Butler is not back. That's the weight. You know, that's the weight you're at, 74. Looking at that, not having him as a workout partner, how, was that something where when he transferred, you were you kind of surprised by that? I was surprised that he transferred, but uh, by no means I think it uh, hurt me at all. I mean, I, I have more training partners than I could ever ask for. Uh, coaches, uh, teammates, uh, I'm surrounded by some of the best some of the guys, some of the guys that are going to be the best wrestlers in the country. I, I train with them every day. We got young guys on the team, and uh, we're going to be a force to be reckoned with. So uh, I don't think that that affected me too much. Uh, it would have been nice to have a, another good training partner, but I got plenty around me. Looking at Asky, he is a monster. He's like huge, mm -hmm. way taller than you. You're not the biggest 174 punter. Is that something you guys could definitely take into and factor into whether you're going to wrestle or not? Yeah, so we came in the tournament. We knew I would be one of the biggest uh, guys at the weight. So we looked at it as, uh, you know, I'm going to be feeling fresh. Uh, I got, Winner's bracket, I got 125 so semifinals. Be ready. You're coming up. 125 semis. Get ready. And I got that opportunity. Next but I also think I can compete with anybody in the country. So I got that opportunity if I if we decide to do that. Like, uh, uh, I mean, we got to make that decision this week, but if we decide for me to wrestle, you know, we still got Tyler Askey. He's a great wrestler. I train with him, and uh, he'd, do just, he'd, do, he'd do great there, too, but we got to figure out what's best for the team. Looking at that, when is the first competition where we would know whether they're going to show you or not and, and redshirt you or wrestle you? When are we going to know? When's your first duel, I guess? I, I have no clue what, what the you know the schedule? Well, I know in the first duel we got, we're going up to North Dakota, uh, Fargo, North Dakota, for wrestle four duels this next week. But I got to sit down with the coaches. I haven't talked to the coaches. Gotcha. So that was, we would we would know by then, usually. Maybe. Okay. Maybe. All right. So Or they could hold you. It's a long so season. That is a long season. Happen. All right, Box, you got anything else for me? Uh, just go who's. Where's the helmet, time. dude? The helmet. The helmet's over there with my dad. He he had more fun than I did today, I think. Uh, <laughs> he got to be in my corner, you know, with me red shirting. So. Is your dad, your dad lives in Florida, right? Yeah, my dad lives in Florida. They flew up to uh, Charlottesville and drove up with me. It was fun. Really? Yeah. Those parents care. All right, man. Congratulations. Got anything else for me? Glory to God.